Welcome back to Scene. Artists in the West Village of Greenville want you to be part of the growing art movement there with the First Friday Art Crawl. We have some fine folks in studio with us. We have Karen Dillingham, owner of West Wind Tie-Dye, and one of the artists there, Duma Morgan, as well. Good to see you guys. Good, Good to see, see you. Tie-Dye just makes you happy. All these bright colors, <laughs> you can't help but smile when you see that. And uh, for First Friday coming up, this Friday, you want people to come in and, and check out what's going on at the artistry. Tell us about that. Absolutely. We'll be open from 6 to 9 on Friday for the um, first Friday art crawl. Mm -hmm. We have eight artists in the gallery now. We've got a full complement. Uh, each one has their own studio. Their studios will be open. We'll have resident art on display. We've got two blacksmiths. Of course, Duma Morgan mm -hmm. just uh, joined us, and he's a live painter. Um, the painting on your right Right, was this done really at a concert, cool. Really cool. Uh, Marcus King Band, and uh, he's tearing it up nationally. Like, I mean, he's yeah, a, worldwide. We, we, we claim him <laughs> because he's, you know, he's from here, but his talent is kind of going all over, all over the world. And so, t what are the challenges with doing like a live painting? I mean, you're at a concert, and this is what you see. Um, it's probably the biggest challenge is painting in front of a bunch of people because everybody wants but, to come up and yeah, and but look it's at nice. It. And it's nice. Everybody enjoys coming up and seeing it. The progress of the painting, and then at the end, I get the band to sign the back, so that adds, adds a value. really, really nice, <laughs> more value to it. Yeah. to it. Yeah, especially when someone like Marcus King too, and, and oh, yeah. somebody's gonna want want that as well. Do you have other artists, other musicians? Yes, yes. That's probably one of my favorite things to paint live is is bands, but also do events and weddings and um, uh, do plein air landscape painting and. And they'll be so, able to see some more examples of that when they drop oh, by yeah. your, your studio, too. Yes. Really, really cool work. And Karen, I love your pieces as well. <laughs> you, you take tie-dye to the next level and you put it on all types of things. Tell us about your products. Well, uh, each piece is hand-wrapped, hand-dyed uh, individually. So, you know, where I did some socks this year, I had to do some for Clemson. Of course, <laughs> I had to do some for Carolina, of too. Of course, yeah. And, uh, of course, you don't want to forget the kids. But yeah. uh, T-shirts and just bright things for when the spring comes back make you remember, you know, or what in, makes you happy. Yeah, in the winter when you need a little bit of color to kind of spruce you up a little Little bit you can do. They make great gift ideas too because you know who doesn't want a, a, something that's been handmade and hand designed. Absolutely, and I'll have my whole stock out for everybody to look at and uh, enjoy. So uh, I hope everybody will come by and see. We'll have the uh, metal shop open, mm -hmm. and Ryan and his assistants will be doing some uh, uh, metal work for everybody. And it's fascinating if you've never seen Ryan in action. Oh, it, it is. You probably have because he's at Fall for Greenville all the time, and they heat up red hot. Hot, and then they twist that metal and make it do all kinds of cool things. <laughs> awesome. So it'll be a really fun time. And then after the event, we'll have a DJ doing a little dance party in the warehouse. So uh, that's a, a little bit separate, but uh, also fun. Um, we're doing a tiny float contest as well <laughs> for our Big Easy costume ball. And February you said that's something 3rd. they do in New, New Orleans, like with the tiny. Yes, the kids in New Orleans take shoe boxes and they make uh, tiny floats that are, you know, miniatures of what you would see in the Mardi Gras parades. And you, anybody and can join that and make their own? And Absolutely. <laughs> so we have a little contest and on this Friday we're going to have shoe boxes available for folks that want to sign up and you can make your float, bring it back and then at our Big Easy Costume Ball we'll be, be voting for the best float and we'll have some little prizes and stuff but mostly it's just uh, getting to win and getting that prowess. Really fun. You guys have it going on over there. Of course you can check out all the things going on at the artistry at theartistrygallery.com and you can uh, check those out but go and visit them this Friday and say hello pop into their studios Duma and Karen thank you guys so much happy thank new you. year to you guys happy new year happy we'll see new you year. soon